Hey guys, welcome back to the Boho Bay Boomsday. So I did a few things today for the garden. Don't mind the mess. I'm just doing this to add some nutrients to the soil, some extra boost. So I did a previous video on the sour sub tree. I got finished pruning it. Just get it away from the roof house because the roof is going to extend. So this is what it looks like now. So it's just leaning to one side and not the big spread that I liked before. But I had to get it off because when I cut that limb, it fell on the roof. So I had to do that. And the roof is going to come all the way out here. And that's where the tree is. So I had to do some trimming, so I did that as well as got the dry branches off. Also, I pulled these plants back towards the fence. That way the roots of the plant can get better airflow. And this bed here can get some sunlight. But I have pumpkin here a cucumber and some watermelon so i'm just gonna let this take over the front of the yard get some greener greens and i sprinkled some zinnias in there so they probably spring up too as well as some roselle hibiscus over here and there those are purple alamandas and wild petunias those are gonna be really pretty when they start blooming so yeah that's what i did so that bed is getting more sun and these guys are going so they fell over during the weather the other day and so i just tied them up as well as i'm trimming these I don't remember what they're called. I don't remember the current name for them. I call them Evergreen or Evergrow, whatever I got this done. So I'm trying to create the arch that I did on the other side. So that, and I snip the tops off the ones that I can reach because I don't want them to get any taller, but I do want them for a privacy screen. And this finally got around to getting some dirt in this lemongrass bed right here also did some light trimming along the garden beds and weeding so yeah I have a lot of plants coming up so stay tuned for those